Family Guy seems to always be one step ahead of the news, most recently with the wave of fuel predators in Hollywood. The creators of the hit Fox series spoke with The Hollywood Reporter ahead of the show's 300th episode and discussed how they joked about Kevin Spacey's behavior before he was accused in the media of fully assaulting young men. In a 2005 episode titled Don't Make Me Over, Stewie runs through a mall and shouts Help, I've escaped from Kevin Spacey's basement. Help me. Obviously, it's a terrible thing to say, how we've had a lot of good luck predicting wool predators, but I do think a lot of people, like Kevin Spacey, there have always been rumors out there about him, showrunner Aaron Sulkin told THR. So we will just kind of say those things. We write things that we hear about and then a year and a half later, they're on TV and then ten years later they happen. Most of the show's content stemmed from rumors the writers heard, according to fellow showrunner Richard Apple and the show's creator Seth MacFarlane. The Kevin Spacey thing is something I had not heard when it was pitched, MacFarlane said. The Family Guy writers have always had very open ears. And I think a lot of these things were things that were talked about and whispered about in Hollywood, but nobody had any direct anecdotal information about what was really going on, so all you had to work with was rumor. Paid content by Compare Cards have debt McFarlane also made one of the first public jokes about Weinstein's inappropriate behavior at the 2013 Oscars. He made the comment after learning his friend and Ted co-star Jessica Bath wagely harassed by Weinstein in 2011. After reading the five actresses nominated for the supporting actress category, McFarlane said, Congratulations, you five ladies no longer have to pretend to be attracted to Harvey Weinstein. The Weinstein thing, I had a very good friend who had a very troubling run in, and I despised the guy for direct reasons, McFarlane said, noting the differences. As for what makes it to the screen on Family Guy, Apple explained that it has to have some basis for a joke since the legal department finally combs the content. Either there has to be some basis for a joke or it has to be so insane and unbelievable that no one would take it seriously, he said. And honestly, in some of these instances both were true.